One of the top features in Origin 2019 is the new Start menu. This feature is accessible by clicking on the icon in the lower left corner of the Origin interface or by pressing F1 when no other dialog is open. When the Start menu launches, you'll see several sections. The topmost section shows recent Origin projects that you have opened in your past Origin sessions. Then there is a section for menus you have recently accessed. Two items in that menu section are the App Center, which lets you quickly find and install apps, and the Learning Center, which lets you open graph samples, analysis samples, and other learning resources quickly. Those two menu items are always present, followed by other menu items that you have accessed in the past. Then, a section on apps that you have recently used. And finally, there is a section where you can type keywords to search. For example, I have in the past searched kernel density. So if I choose that phrase, then Origin immediately shows various resources available. A sample project about kernel density, menu items, apps that are available for download, and videos. So for example, if you want to get the Kernel Density app, simply click that button to open the app page. You can browse and review and then download the file. Now let's go back and look at how to customize the search feature. There is a settings dialog that can be opened by clicking on this icon. Here you can choose whether to use AND versus OR for multiple term search or whether you want to turn on fuzzy search for allowing misspelled words, whether you want a compact or more elaborate display, and various search categories, whether you want to show help items or not, apps, videos, X function, project file, samples, and so forth. Please note that the search can also be customized by typing single letters, such as M for menu, a for app, and etc. Let me demonstrate a few of those. Let's say I want to find all the menu items related to ANOVA. Rather than searching through all the menu items, I can simply come here and type M ANOVA. Then all available items will be shown. Let's say I want to find apps available for curve fitting. I simply type A and fitting and Origin will display all the apps available. Those that are already installed are shown with a check mark. So if I want to choose Fitting Function Library, which is already installed, I can simply click the selection and the apps open. As we saw before, if you want to install an app that you don't already have, you can simply select it and download. Let's look at narrowing the search for videos. Say I want to look at videos available for graphing. The search will display all available videos. And say I want to learn about trellis plots. I will select it and then be taken to a page to view that particular video. Similarly, if I want to find samples, for example, sample projects on contour plotting, Origin shows all of the available sample projects. By simply hovering on the item, a pop-up will appear. Simply click a project that you want to look at, and the project will open and you'll be able to play around with the data and adjust the graph accordingly. You can even replace it with your own data. Back to the Start menu, Recent projects are shown above. I have a project that I recently opened called Sensor1. I simply select the project to reopen it. But note that if I type P for project and sensor, not only does it show recent projects, but other projects with similar names in the same folder. So this can be a quick way to find projects from recently used folders, so you can quickly open them. We hope you find this video very useful. 
We believe this is useful for both novice users and also for experienced Origin users to quickly find menu items and apps and help files efficiently. Thank you for watching.